so I wanted to gather a group of adventurous spirited women who would be open to doing a new event each month. And it would, wouldn't just be any kind of event, it would be something that would push people out of their comfort zone, they would try new things that they've never tried before, but with the support of a whole group of women who are also trying something new. And um, the only restriction, there are actually no restrictions for what kind of events it can be other than no bungee jumping and skydiving. And it can't be life-threatening. Um, so it's just a fun way for women to come together, to bond together, and to have a good time, and to learn, and explore, and um, support one another, and really kind of overcome that sweaty palm feeling when you're trying something that you've never tried before, and it kind of gives you those sweaty palms, and you have to figure out how to overcome that feeling and um, try something new. I love WAG because it's always a surprise. And as soon as we get instructions for what we're supposed to wear or bring or do, I always start thinking about a million things about what we might be doing, and usually I'm wrong. Um, and um, But sometimes I get my ideas from my wrong ideas. Um, I think the best thing about WAG for me is that it's really taught me how important and nourishing having friendships with women is. Um, for a long time I was, you know, married and had you know, my husband and my kids and sort of forgot about how important having a lot of good women in my life really is. Ice block sledding in the grass. We met at the park and everybody sauntered up the hill and we were all received these giant ice blocks which we then lugged to the sledding hill on our beach towels. Then we just started sliding down the hill and it was so silly and it was so messy and we we laughed the whole way down. Um, it was really fun because we tried doing it as partners and then we all tried hooking our legs around each other and doing it as a train and most of the time we just rolled off and ended up sliding down the hill and the more we did it the wetter the grass became and the wetter our clothes became and uh, it just got sloppier and sloppier and we had grass in our underwear and in our armpits and in our hair and in our mouths and it was just it was hilarious and we giggled and giggled and we just had so much fun it was a childlike un ungrown up afternoon that we all just completely enjoyed the activity and enjoyed each other's company uh, and it was just and it was just so much fun it's important to me because it gives me an outlet to be uh, with my girlfriends, something that my family doesn't give me. This is the essence of WAG. Even when you don't know what you're doing, you still get to do whatever you want to do. Okay, now, okay. Yeah, read it. Okay, do you, do you remember what it's like to be a little girl without any restrictions and to be totally carefree that you can just bebop around the room and dance to Hannah Montana without any judgment. WAG releases the restraints and restrictions we put on ourselves to be that little girl again for just a day or maybe even just a few hours. Even though you're in this group setting and it's you just having a complete ball with ten different pe ten other women and you're just being 100% yourselves, something else is going on inside that is just a personal thing that you realize that through your motherhood and through your being a wife, you've lost that. And, um, it all of a sudden happens for you, you know, and we call it a pee way, personal way. The sweaty palms, the laughing, the giggling, and we cry too, totally, we totally cry. But it's, it's more than that, it's the connection, it's the shared experience, it's the personal journey that you have, but in the caring, loving atmosphere of a shared group. WAG brings me joy, inspiration, beauty, power, honesty, and um, from what I can tell brings it to everyone around me. It empowered me to be someone that I wasn't before. I was very, I was kind of shy and nervous when I started and it really made me feel like I belonged to a group. And I just, and the, the greatest part of this group is they're so diverse. We've got girls, you know, that are wealthy, we've got girls that aren't wealthy, we've got girls that are from every kind of job, there's some stay-at-home moms, some are still working, and it just put a group together of different women. We didn't know each other, we weren't buddies, we weren't neighbors, and everyone there is so supportive of each other, and, and, and so loving and caring, and that's the best part, is you come, I don't see these girls all the time, you know, I'm just with them once a month, 
and we go and do, challenge ourselves to something new every month. We, we do something that's awesome. I would never in a million years want to learn to scuba dive. I've scuba dived. I couldn't believe I was jumping in the pool, you know. And I'm jumping in a pool and nervous, and then when I got there, I was like, wow, this is so freeing and wonderful. And I mean, we just do so many things that are, that are just things I would never do in my life without a group of women behind me. It makes me want to inspire other women to do the same thing. It means love, friendship, sharing, and strong shoulders to hold you up when you feel like you can only fall down. It means too much wine, martinis, beer, and always non-stop laughter. WAG means opening up to people when you're so used to keeping up your walls. WAG is recognizing all the beauty and awe-inspiring gifts and talents in all of you. I'm only truly grateful that I am a part of WAG. It's the best hot tub ever. Ten people. Where was it? In my backyard. She rented a hot tub oh. from an old boyfriend. <laughs> from an old boyfriend. <laughs> yeah, that was the whole. He can't make a deal. I bet he did. Yeah. <laughs> that was the whole thing. We were rolling. We're like, money. No, I think that you would get an ex-boyfriend to drop off a hot tub for a few days <laughs> and then pick it back up. We were dying. As moms and as women, that we need things that are all about us. And it really is an opportunity to celebrate together, to explore, and to learn, and to have a good time. And it's just been a wonderful experience for me, I know, and I know for all the rest of the WAG women. It's been something that has been a real special part of our lives. WAG is, is a challenge, but WAG is also security because the friendships that I'm making, that I'm growing, the women that I'm taking the time to get to know, I will have forever. If I'm in WAG, if I ever, please don't ever let me leave WAG. But if I'm out of WAG, these women I will never forget. Ever.